Hey y'all. Uh, so I know I haven't posted it in a minute and I can explain that another time, but this video I just want to post because God has delivered me and I just want to give this testimony right here. Now I posted my testimony or really two testimonies um, prior on my video on my channel um, talking about, you know, what God's done in my life and how he's delivered me, but I didn't realize there were still deep things in me, you know, deep demonic things that were still there that needed to come out, be cast out. I thought, you know, I was free because I prayed to be free and I prayed, got prayed over and I um, repented and all of these things. I was following God, received Holy Spirit, all this stuff. But, um, you know, God has been showing me how I still needed to be free and all this stuff, especially, I'll just say like specifically in with fear and shame. Um, I, you know, I was seeing that come up more and more and more, even when I started a relationship with Joshua, just like anxiety issues and like fear of bugs were very strong, like really strong. They weren't coming out of nowhere, I won't say, but I feel like they were stronger than they had used to been, than they used to have been. Um, and then like shame coming up more and more, especially after we got married, you know, making it difficult to be intimate and things like that. So just want to share that um i want to start with first a couple a couple of weeks ago was it or a week ago do you know what i'm talking about a couple of weeks sorry josh was filming okay because i lost we broke our tripod so anyway oh. um so, so a couple of weeks ago i think or something i remember we were going to sleep um and mm -hmm. i just felt like for some reason, I got the idea in my head, like, um, of like, I can renounce these demons in me, like, um, any demon of lust, any spirit of lust, any spirit of fear, any spirit of shame, come out in Jesus' name. Jesus is greater than you. Jesus has more power than you in Jesus' name. Any spirit, any bad spirit in me, any spirit of witchcraft, get out in Jesus' name. And I just kept thinking that in my head. I wasn't even saying it out loud. It was in my head. And I started, like, as I was doing that, I was like, oh, like, I was feeling, like, things. And Joshua was next to me, like, what are you doing? What is happening? Are you okay? I thought we were going to sleep. <laughs> and I was like, oh. And I just kept doing it. And then it started to be bigger and bigger. And they started manifesting. And, it, like, the demons were, like, manifesting in me. And I started, like, I eventually I started screaming. And I was like, ah, I just, I just really want them to come out. Like, I had this, fear, like, very intense feeling. I just wanted them to be out and I was screaming and Joshua was like oh okay this is serious so we started praying and I was like Jesus blah, 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 whatever pray and I was just screaming and screaming and I got to the point where I was on the or I was leaning over the bed about to get on the ground and I was crying and screaming and it got to the point where like I started feeling calmer um and I was crying and I was like and I felt so bad I, I was telling Jesus I'm so sorry I didn't believe you fully about like deliverance and just like your power and all of these things um and so I really felt like, you know, convicted and really sorry for it. And I kept just saying sorry and stuff. But um, I, I felt like I, I wanted to be like, okay, they're all out. But I also felt like they're not. I remember when I was in my head was trying to cast out that spirit of fear. I remember saying like, um, I've been, I've been here for so long. Like I've been buried deep in here. Like this is my home. I've been buried deep in here for so long. And I was like, I don't care, come out, in Jesus' name, you know, but um, I don't, but that, that time, though they manifested, it wasn't like complete yet, because um, I still had been dealing with fear, I still have been dealing with fear, I still have been dealing with shame deeply, um, and those things, um, you know, God has been working with me and helping me, I think that did help some, um, in terms of like some, I don't know, anyway, but yeah. So I was like, okay, but I still want to believe that I was, you know, fully free, or I still want to be the, the believe that they were gone, I should say. Um, but you know, I could see that they weren't fully. Um, so fast forward to today, which I'm posting this the next day. So really, it's, it was yesterday. But uh, what's today, babe? <laughs> the eighth. <laughs> okay, April eighth, twenty twenty two. Um, we have, we went to an event that Catherine Crick, Apostle Catherine Crick 
was uh, going to be preaching at and, del and um, being used by God to deliver or God delivering through her. You know, you know what I mean? Because uh, we had been watching her on YouTube uh, not that like pretty recently, like mm -hmm. the past week or two. Um, and then we found out that she was coming to Orlando this weekend. So we're like, bet. So we went, uh, which is where we just moved, which ties into why I haven't posted. Anyway, going back to, sorry. But anyway, so uh, we were like, bet, let's go. So we went tonight. Um, and uh, as she was just uh, declaring, you know, deliverance and like if anything's manifesting in you and stuff, I just felt like, because she was saying to renounce any bad spirit, any open door that you could have had the devil walk through and stuff. So I was renouncing fear and that felt so strong that that, was about to manifest or starting to manifest and renouncing shame that felt so strong um so as you're saying if anything's manifesting i'm standing next to joshua just like going like, trying to muffle screams because i i felt like so embarrassed i guess or i didn't want to be screaming with all these people around me in the back of the we were in the back so i was just like um <laughs> i was trying to muffle all the screams that i wanted to to to, to let out um, the, I was crying profusely. Is that the right term? Profusely? Or I was just crying a lot, okay? Right, yeah. And I was sitting next to Joshua just like, ah, whatever. Um, but finally when she said, like, anyone feeling manifestations, please come up. Joshua was like, you want to go up? I was like, ah, yes. <laughs> So he carried me up there. Or I should say carried. <laughs> he led me up there. Like, he, he went up there with me, which is nice. Um, at least to the stage. Um and uh if you want to watch this i was actually recorded my goodness jesus is good though i was recorded so you could see on her channel um a video that was posted with me up there um with her praying over me uh, i'll post it it should be a link like up here in this video for the link but i also say other times in the link in the description if you want to watch what that looked like but basically when we went up there and i was crying and trying not to scream and muffling they finally, like at some point, when, uh, she called me up and was like, you know, uh, we're going to free you. Is there anything we need to renounce? And I, at first, I couldn't talk. Like, they put the mic to me, and I was like, ah, 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 and I really just wanted to talk. Like, not just talk, but I wanted to say I renounce fear first. But it was hard for me to even say it. Like, I couldn't even let it out. And she was like... And I knew it, and I was like, I know this is the demon, but I'm going to say I want to, but I couldn't at the time. Um, and she, you know, in Jesus' name, she was like, uh, you know, let her talk and stuff. So I finally said I renounced fear very shakily. I was still crying. I felt, all I thought was, I'm very snotty right now, but I want these things to be out. Um, but I was like, I renounce fear. I renounce shame. I renounce sexual immorality in Jesus' name. Those are the words that, those are the thoughts that came. And... When I said fear and shame, that's when it was really like shaky. And I was, I started to now, I was not just muffling screams. I was screaming because I could feel like, I just felt so intense, like wanted them out. And I felt like that was the only way, I don't know how to describe it. That was the only way though, that I could let them out in, in the screaming. Like that was just, I don't know. It was like the automatic, ah, like, yeah, it wasn't just frustration. It was like this is how you're going to get out of me and screaming it about screaming them out, I guess, but also just like manifestations of them. Um, it was just screaming. I don't know how to describe that. Um, but yeah, so I was just screaming and crying. <laughs> she was praying. She was like, you renounce this, you know, declare freedom in Jesus name. I don't really know what she was saying. All I know is that I was screaming and I was crying, but finally the scream slowed down. Okay, we're back. My alarm went off. So anyway, I, this isn't going to be edited, so I apologize for all this extra stuff. But as I was screaming and um, crying, I was fall it was slowly going to the ground. And I finally felt like, yeah, finally was done screaming. I kept crying, but I finally felt like this time I knew I was free. It was different than the last time where I was like, I don't know if they're all out. I don't know if I'm fully free from them. But this one, I was like, I know I'm free. And I was like, just still crying. So I was still processing, but I was grateful to God. Because the as I was like crying and screaming, all I was thinking was like, Jesus, please help me. Jesus, Jesus. And he did. And he really came through. And I got down from the stage. Went to Joshua's arms. I was still crying. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But finally, when we got to our seats, 
And I thought of the fact that there was no more shame. I just couldn't help but smiling and laughing. And that there was no more fear. I just couldn't help but smiling and laughing. Every time I thought of it, like I was like, <laughs> I felt like I'm, I felt like, oh, what's she doing over there? But I just <laughs> couldn't stop laughing. But it was just felt so freeing and good. And seeing that that was true and real um, and that God really wanted to free me and has been wanting to and we're still learning about this whole process but just wanted to share that with you uh feel free to check out that video or that clip if you want um but yeah freedom okay why don't you quickly uh just pray for anyone watching um you know that they receive the spirit or if they need to be delivered you know okay. we believe we're learning that even through video yeah you can be set free so yeah. why don't you just you know say a prayer yeah yeah thanks yeah so let's um all those who want to be free from something whether they know it or not or whether they feel have felt manifestations or um you felt just anxiety or fear or depression or suicidal thoughts or um or ha ah, so many things that seem to mind or mental disorders like bipolar disorder or um, gender identity issues or sexual orientation issues like homosexuality and those things. All those people who have felt, um, you know, all those people who want to be free. Um, I just pray for you right now in Jesus name. I pray that you are free from that demonic spirit of fear, free free from that demonic spirit of shame and guilt, free from any spirits of bad religion, of false religion in Jesus name. I pray, I pray, Lord God, thank you, God. I pray in the spirit, Lord God, thank you, God. In Jesus name, any spirit of homosexuality be freed in Jesus name, any spirit of false identity be freed in Jesus name any spirit of confusion in Jesus name be freed I just pray against every bad spirit any spirit of witchcraft be free in Jesus name every spirit every evil spirit be cast out of the people that are watching in Jesus name as you surrender and as you renounce 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 any bad thing as you do that just accept god's freedom in jesus name those who are watching because in jesus name you can and will be free by his holy spirit and by his power in jesus name in jesus name and as demons are being cast out of you you are free in jesus name amen, amen. all right